Ilan est-il mort parce que juif And this is the question that not only the outraged Jewish community, but all of France is asking. Was this innocent young man, Ilan Alimi, kidnapped and tortured for days because he was Jewish? Nous devons la vérité à la famille d'Ilan. Nous vous devons la vérité. Nous devons la vérité à tous les Français. But what will this truth be? The young Jews who organized this protest in central Paris near the store where Ilan worked and from which he was abducted are convinced that the kidnappers chose their victim because he was Jewish. Now, France is beginning to admit that the young protesters are right. This young woman is suspected of seducing several young Jewish men. Her last victim, about a month ago, was 23-year-old Ilan, whom she lured into the web of a barbaric criminal gang. He was held here. The gang demanded a large ransom from his family, and the negotiations reached a dead end. When the family told the kidnappers it didn't have enough money, the kidnappers replied, get the money from your synagogue. In the end, Ilan was found near a railway station, naked, his body covered with burns. La seule réaction qu'on puisse avoir euh, est déjà une, une situation, on va dire, de, de dégoût par rapport à, à la barbarie avec laquelle a été perpétrée en fait la, la, le crime. Seven suspects have been arrested, but the suspected leader of the gang managed to escape to the Ivory Coast. It's difficult at a time like this not to believe the worst. France has seen a sharp decline in the number of anti-Semitic incidents last year, but in this case, it seems. The French police have closed their eyes to the anti-Semitic nature of the crime, despite the family's insistence. The police acted too late, and the price of their delay was this innocent young man's life.